Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another Celtic transfer talk video or such breaking news. It's one that is not even linked with Celtic, I don't think, anyway. It was out of the moon. <laughs> out of, just bang on, opened my phone this morning, hopped on Instagram. First thing I seen, we have reached an agreement to sign Japanese internationalist Kyogo Furashi, subject to satisfaction of usual conditions of international clearance. Now, he is a, a striker. So now, I like it, I like that um, Ange Posco is going in the market for a striker because we need one because obviously I do not see Celt in Celtic putting Lee Griffiths on and they shouldn't at all, even though they've, they've cleared, police have cleared them, no way he should play for Celtic ever again, through contract right back in the face with all this situation. Um, the J-League side have confirmed an agreement has been made between both clubs. The striker has scored 14 goals in 20 games this season, wow, that's really good, 14 goals in 20 games, that, whoa. That's like that's only like six away from like the whole entire. I mean, in twenty games he's played, that's really good. Um, Celtic are delighted to announce they've reached their game. Um, the twenty-six-year-old forward is regarded as one of the most exciting talents in Japanese football and will join Celtic on a four-year deal. He's current top scorer in the J One League, the top division in Japan, with fourteen goals in twenty games, as I said there. And he is a teammate of Spanish football legend Andreas Iniesta, um, who captains the side. That's you know. Um, Celtic manager Hans Poscoglu said we are delighted to bring uh, Kyogo Farashi in to Celtic. He is a player of real quality and clear, someone I know very well. He's obviously, Hans Poscoglu obviously managed a Japanese side uh, in J-League um, before he came to Celtic, obviously. So, um, what do you call it? Um, so he knows everybody out there, you know, who's a good player and all that stuff. and. You know, when he came to Celtic, he's thinking, you know, I mean, we could bring some couple of good players over, in his opinion. We've already got one in Kyogo Furashi. Hopefully, as he's um, he also added, I think he'll add something special to our squad, and I'm sure the way he plays will excite our supporters, which we need. We need excitement back to our play. We've seen a wee bit of that in the pre season game um, against the Challenge game in the first half. We've seen it. Exciting football, you couldn't keep your eyes off it, which you like to see, because last season you were, you were thinking of things today, because the football was really boring. But this season, hopefully, we see some exciting football and talent on the park. Um, Kyogo Furhashi has helped Vissel Kobe win the only trophies in his club's history so far. The Emperor's Club Cup when they beat Kashima Antlers 2-0 in the final on New Year's Day 2020 and the subsequent Japanese Super Cup. So there you go. Uh, the match against the J1 League champions, Yokama F. Manos, who were... I was managed by the, the new Celtic manager now, Ange Poscoglu. Saw Kyle go for a shit uh, score in the 3 3 draw. The official Kobe or Kobe winning the penalty shootout. Now, having faced Ange Poscoglu's side in Japan, Kyle go for Hashi will now play under the Australian manager at Celtic, which is I'm really excited to see. Uh, Kyle go, well, who made his international debut against Venezuela in November 2019, has scored three goals and six appearances for Japan. Now, from what I've seen, he's some player. He looks a, a cracking player in the park. Apart, apart, uh, apparently, it's close to five million fee. It's a great sign for me, to be honest. It's a great sign. Shows that Ange knew what positions he wanted and wanted there. It's not like Lennon, where we just spent out in random players last season. Do you know what I mean? We got the players that we needed so far. We've got, obviously, we've got Azazar Dagiri. We've got Leo Abada coming in as a winger. We've got a striker now in um, Kyogo uh, for. Furu Hashi, Hashi, I'm going to get that name very sorted very soon, but it's going to take a while, but here we go guys, we have signed him on a four year contract um, from Japan, and some people are obviously coming to say, you know, um, what do you call it, next Nakamura, hopefully he is, you know, um, hopefully he realise he's, he's a real talent to be honest though, um, but hopefully um, we see more of him obviously in the pre-season, not too soon, and hopefully we see him in the coming future in the league, the, obviously the league, um, the league, hopefully we can do so. Striker, which we need because, um, if you're talking obviously Griffiths should never play for Celtic again, because of that oh instant, doesn't deserve to wear a Celtic shirt ever again. Um, you're talking a Edward and a Yeti, so you're talking, if Edward will go, I don't know if he will go, but if he does, you know, you've only got a Yeti, and then you look down at your youth team and stuff, so, this guy here, Kyogo Furu, Furu uh, Hashi, he's came in, he's, he's 26 year old, um, 
he has got 14 goals in 20 games this that season there. So hopefully he does the same for Celtic. More goals, we want more goals. A striker that I think he's going to be good as a cracking player so far. He looks apart. So hopefully he does, guys. Make sure to scream like, share the video out, and hopefully this is only the start of the sign. So sign also Leo Bada, Zaza Origidi, and Leo uh, Kyogo. The new one today, which I'm doing a video on, Kyogo Furuhashi. Please scream like, as I said there, guys. Share the video as per usual. I'll see you guys in the next video very shortly.